Is this something about an artist performing the song, you know, that they release live? You know, is this like a different atmosphere and there's just something unique about the song when it comes to it being performed by an, an artist than it, you know, just being listened as just a song. So we got Jim and Set Me Free. We already did a reaction to the actual song. Go check it out. It's already on my YouTube channel. Uh, so this is Set Me Free Part 2 live performance. It's in I Chicago. I don't know if I pronounced that right or wrong. Please let me know. Sorry if I did. So yeah, let's get into it. This is the live performance. So I I'm looking forward to it, guys. Let's get it. <laughs> Sorry, it's six second in, and I, I I already had like questions, you know, like that's what I'm saying. Like performance live is unique, and it brings you different perspective of the song or like the video, and that's what I was wondering. Like with the video, we saw how like you know they came in with the angle of every shot at the beginning. So I was wondering, are they gonna do the same thing here, or you know, are they just gonna go straight into performing it? But it seemed like they're bringing back the you know the angle shots and everything. So let's see it. Yeah, there you go. Telling you right now, he's a badass motherfucker, man. Look at that walk, man. Main character slash villain. Bro, I like how they kept the identity of the video song in the performance still. That's 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 amazing, you know? Cause And there's also a little bit difference, like the artist is in like I mean he might it's only like fifty seconds into the song, he might actually start dancing. I mean he's kinda dancing with them, but you know he's kinda like mainly focusing so he can sing too. But I like that about it, like, you know, there's a little change to it, yet is it, it's not so much different, you know, from what it's originally is. I like that. Bruh, I love everything about this stage setup. Just the way the messing around with the camera, you know, just to take to stick to the originality of the video, you know, that was original with this song, and then the lighting. Everything is just so good. I like it how they set it up. I like it. Oh. <laughs> what was that little dancey there? Bro, also is this Yeah man, the atmosphere is crazy. Hey, yeah. <laughs> I can't believe I reacted to this yesterday and I still haven't got over it, man. I literally reacted to the actual song last night and I dropped it. You guys showed it a massive love and you guys are still showing it massive love. So thank you guys for that. But I still can't get over it, the fact that he was swearing and he was actually talking his shit. Like, it's just... Ugh. Yeah. 
You all play too much, man. Matter of fact, I'll add this song to my playlist just right now. Give me a moment, okay? Give me a moment. Give me a moment. Give me a moment. Yeah. Send me free part two. Explit it. Which playlist? Which playlist? All right. All right. We got it. We got it. Sorry for that, but I just had to add it, man. Oh, did he is hearing? Yeah, 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 bro. Nah, sorry, my voice sucks. Yeah, I know, I know, but hey, man. What? No, 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 no. Take it back, bro. Are you just seeing this? Does everybody have like a glowing headphones? I think everybody does. That's nuts. Yo, where is this place, man? Take me there. No. Ain't no way, man. Is that actually headphones or am I just tripping because I just saw that little glimpse, you know? But it looked like it's headphones and they're glowing. Yeah, man. <laughs> Sorry, sorry, but I can't take this thought off. Like, you guys are gonna hear it in the other video that I just reacted to. The Serenity performance, live performance that he did. I still, I just finished reacting to that video and I made a take, like, you know, I would love to see a Jimin and Chris Brown collaboration. Like, I just cannot see it. Every time I see Jimin, I'm like, Chris Brown, you know? Like, this two will perfectly, oh my God. Just let me know. Let me know in the comment. Let me know. Let me know, okay? I, I I don't know. You guys can help me, you know. Give me a different idea of artists that, you know, can collaborate and do a, such a good song with Jimin. Or just BTS members in general. But I thought Chris Brown, man, you know. Yeah, everything. Dancing. Singing. Oh, my God. But let's get... Let's finish this, man. <laughs> I think that's pretty much it. All right, it's safe to click it out. All right. Anyway, man, that's Jim and Send Me Free Part Two live performance. This, like I told you guys, there's just something about performing live that artists just bring a different energy, and the song feels different, but it's not different. It's just the same song that you've been listening to since it was released. But you know. It's crazy, man, but you guys let me know about some of the stuff that I said, you know, Chris Brown collaboration, you know, and keep recommending live performance stuff from BTS. I I'll love to see them performing live, you know, so I hope you guys enjoyed the reaction. If you guys did, please don't forget to subscribe, like, and, you know, share the videos if you can, and yeah, let me know your thoughts in the comment, okay? I can't wait to hear them, so I'll see you guys next time. Peace.